This video follows the setting up section of the 620M user guide. We're going to cover alignment and changing the mounts on the 620M chambers. You will need your screwdriver, your ball end screwdriver, as well as the mounts that came with your system. In order to change from jaws to pins, you need to separate your mounts, remove the chamber cover, use your ball end screwdriver to loosen the first screw closest to the chamber. Loosen that, and then you can remove the jaw mount. Then you will need to take your small screwdriver and loosen the back screw that's closest to the force transducer. Now you'll need to be careful when doing this as you do not want to put extra pressure on the transducer itself. And then you can slide this jaw off the transducer arm and set that aside. To replace the mounts, you will add the pins in the reverse order. So first, we will get the smaller pin, which will connect to the force transducer arm itself. So you will slide that over the arm and you will take your small screwdriver and again, tighten the back screw. And then we will grab the longer armed mount and slide that in to the micrometer side. And take your ball end screwdriver and tighten the closest screw. These will not be perfectly aligned, but you will do that under a microscope in the next step. When aligning your mounts, you have two types of adjustments. You have coarse and fine adjustments. For the coarse adjustments, you can loosen the back screw on the micrometer side or the back screw on the transducer side. If you loosen the back screw on the micrometer, you have some wiggle room with aligning this side. If you loosen the back screw on the transducer side, that arm will swing back and forth, and all you really want is this side to be flat in the chamber. As far as the fine adjustments, you have four screws on the chamber itself. Now there's a pivot point on the bottom of the chamber where as you tighten these screws, you are tightening around that pivot point. So as you tighten the front right screw, it's going to push the chamber down and to the right. So you will keep that in mind as you try to align your mounts. You want the jaws to be level and touching at the same time on both sides. For more information, refer to the 620M user manual or additional resource videos.